With only hours left to the Uganda Matters Day commemoration, pilgrims continue to flock the crowded Namugongo Matters Shrine in long queues. Yeah. <laughs> The security personnel at the various checkpoints are on high alert, constantly frisking the pilgrims for weapons. The officers carry out thorough searches on the pilgrims' bags. Any sharp objects found in the bag are confiscated. Pilgrims who came in earlier have already secured themselves places. Business at the food and beverage points is booming as thousands continue to come in. The security inside the matters grounds is even tighter than before following President Museven's recent confirmation about attending the celebrations. The final preparations are still ongoing. Earlier in the day, those in charge of decorations were still beautifying the area where the mass will be held. The choir that will sing at the mass tomorrow spent the better part of the day getting their notes right. <laughs> Officials from Cotido Diocese who are the main organizers of this year's celebration say all is set for the function. It has been very hectic but it seems we are receiving already joy that yes what we have done will help people to pray and they will go change the people from this. The security situation a few meters away at the Anglican Matters Shrine is not any different, despite the fewer number of Christians. Over the past few days, the turn up here at the Anglican Shrine has been low. But today we are seeing people coming in in big numbers in preparation for tomorrow's celebrations. Many of the pilgrims who came across at this Anglican Shrine were holding rosaries, which struck me as odd, given that rosaries are used by Catholics during prayers. Gertrude Tumusime with Kwari. NTV, I'm going to...